Hey everybody, welcome back to Tara's Traveling Paints. I'm gonna try another pearl. I had success with the last pearl. I can't even believe it. So I'm gonna go ahead and give it a try. It's not completely 100% dry, but I pulled off pearls and I'm super excited. I'm so glad. So I'm gonna go at it again. Uh, things are gonna be a little bit different. I know you can't see my face. I, I went back to work today. First day back to work. I didn't make it that long, but I'm, you know, it, it'll be fine. I feel good about it. So I'm using the leftover paints. I'm gonna use a purple base, which is basically, it's a Sergeant Art. Let me tell you what it is exactly. If I can read it. Spectral Violet mixed with magenta. Okay, that's gonna be my base paint. And then I've got a little black. I've got the sea foam, or what is it? Pearl sea green. I got the copper. I've got the green, which is neon. And I got a little red left. So I think I can pull it off. We're gonna go to 11 by 14, gallery wrapped. Just wanna say thank you for coming and hanging out with me. Sorry I look crazy. I had to put my hair up. I need to take a shower. Whoa, the paint in this pan is insane. Huh. So, anyway, let's go ahead and get into it. Let's just do this. Let's just do it. Um, I noticed that now the videos are starting to look like they're in portrait mode again. So I switched it up, so hopefully we're okay. I, I don't understand these apples. I, not a fan. Just, just so y'all know, I'm not a fan. It's going to be a really great day when I have a good setup and I'm just going to be happy about it. But for now, I'm dealing with what I got and the reason why I went Apple has not panned out. I assumed it would be easier to get the, the material on the computer that I have, which is an Apple. It, it's not the same. It, it does not at all. So why bother, right? I didn't have this problem with Android and Mac and and um, Microsoft. I don't I don't know. So anyway, I'm gonna tilt you down. We got a gallery wrapped. And oh, I that's where I put all those stirrers. All right, I was like, where did they all go? So let's hope that we pull it off again. Let's see. Don't bark. No barking, please. Thank you. She can bark. It's okay. So that's 11 by 14. Pretty excited about it. And this one is a little thicker than all the rest. And the rest are nice and thin. So let's go ahead and get a puddle down. I didn't, uh, I actually did clean the brush in order to be able to, uh, brush out the sides, but I forgot it and I started the recording. And so here we are. We're just going to deal with it. That's what we're going to do. We're not going to freak out. I'm not going to run off on you. Just going to get her done. And I'm kind of excited. Well, actually, I'm always excited. I love to paint. Painting makes me happy. Oh, it was good to be back at work. It's good to hang out with Chris. He's my boss. He's awesome. And I looked at him. I'm like, yeah, I think I've done it. And he was like, but your paycheck. I'm like, I really, right now? I can't really worry about that right this second. Because I need to be able to get my body right so I can get all the other things I need to do done. It's kind of important, you know? So, my check will be fine once it's time for my check to be fine. I am not worried. I might have missed out on a bonus. We had a good month last month. And I was keeping track up until two weeks ago. So, I don't know if I'm going to be included in the bonus round. I don't know. I hope so. I hope so. 
But if not, it's all good. Missing two weeks out of a month might put me in the no bonus for you section. I don't know. I didn't ask him. <laughs> so, yeah. That's the dill. Dillio. Making Salisbury steak tonight. If you don't know... What is it? Sip and Feast on YouTube. Get to it. They're fabulous. It's Tara and her... I don't know the husband's name. I just know her name is Tara, of course, because that's my name. And uh, they say it the way I say it, which I think is pretty cool. And um, he's a chef, and she's the videographer. And it's awesome. It's awesome. And they do such a good job. So I'm making Salisbury steak the way he showed it. I've never had a problem making it on my own, but I'm excited to see how similar it can really be. I, uh, I don't want to get my hands completely dirty, but it's not hot anymore, so I can put gloves on multiple times. I'll be fine. cold today and it snowed and it wasn't supposed to but we don't have much on the ground not much it's just cold and thank goodness it wasn't windy so I was able to do stuff I did the storage walk around that's my thing I love the storage I love storage and um tried to clean two trucks got one done that hurt that, that's painful to pull yourself up into a truck the other one, though, was so far gone, he was like, no, Matt will do that. It was so far gone, I charged the people $200 for cleaning it. That's how bad they left the truck. No, thank you. So I'm just moving this around. I don't know why she's a little excited. Maybe because I'm in here. Maybe my cat's outside. That cat that my, my cat adopted. Maybe. He could be out there. Is he out there? Is a the little man out there? He's got a whole bunch of wet food out there. It's probably froze. But he probably don't care. A little tomcat. I'm pretty sure he belongs to somebody, but my cat adopted him. And he comes over every day to eat. And he's rough and tough. He's definitely a tomcat. And... My cat loses her mind when she can't find him. She gets really upset. She wants him around. She'll go outside and freak out and like, she's pulling her hair out. I think she's in pain. I think she's at her, her uh, last days, which is awful. Because she's, uh, she's survived me a lot over the past few years. A lot. If it weren't for her, let me tell you what. Just saying. So, here we go. Let's see. Alright, I'm going to start with the red. And I'm just going to throw it down. So have a little left. <sighs> Do you hear that? Can you hear that? It's a weird sound. Here we'll go with the bronze. Who knows? World's probably coming into an end or something. Oh! <laughs> oh, my neighbor. Apparently, she has to go somewhere and she's been home all day. And instead of scraping her window, she's letting her windshield wipers do it. Oh, my God. That is not... Don't do that. Just let the car warm up. She's got to, like... She can warm up her car, like, from the house. 
just let it warm up. Oh my goodness. I, I, I can't. <laughs> Anyway, all right, now, got to put some black here and be a little more specific about it. Let's hope that I pull this off. It's not an awful lot of black, but. So it was a good day back at work. It was nice. All right. Going in with the pearl sea green. This is a pretty color. This is beautiful. Right up my alley. I really hope that I pull it off again. I was so excited yesterday. If you watched the video, you saw how stinking excited I was about it. I had never. I mean, I pulled off pearls, but not, not even close. All right, here comes the big one. This is what I got the most of. So I thinned it out so it's no mound. They're all basically the same, except for the bottom is a little bit thicker, just a tiny bit. I guess apparently she likes to buy new windshield wipers. That's all I can think. scared. I love it. I get scared when I shouldn't be, but I am. I'm just really happy I didn't have to change my gloves out. Alright. Find our way. It's a lot of paint. It's probably why I've always been really resistant to these because of the amount of paint that goes down. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I could do it with less paint, but so far, it's worked. And this is my second real attempt at this. Oh. I'm really scared. Terrified. Terrified. But I see it's going to happen. Holy, stop. I wasn't even, gonna, I was going to paint alone today. I wasn't going to do a video. I'm like, I'm waiting for the meat to defrost. So let me go ahead and put on the video. I was watching a, a three hour long interview with Dr. Melba Ketchum with uh, Steve from How to Hunt. Facts by How to Hunt. He's my favorite YouTube channel. I don't know if you guys watch him. He's great. He's manly men. And um, he dives into some interesting subjects. And Dr. Melba Ketchum is a really amazing lady. And he got her on a three-hour interview. And he doesn't do podcasting, per se. So this is like a new field, new way for him to go. These are, what is going on? Look at this. So I figured I would just listen to that while I painted. And I said, no, don't leave my people out. This is crazy, guys. A lot of wonkiness. There's something not quite right with the texture of the paint. Like something is off. But I'm not mad. 
You can see here, something was thicker than it should have been. Do you see that? Otherwise, they'd all be like this. No mud. I'm stoked because I was terrified of mud. Really afraid of mud. Between the green and the red, it's just, it's up in the air, you know what I mean? I mean, some people might consider some of these purpler boulders to be muddy, but I don't. That is insane. What? In oh, the edge. Oh, God, they're so beautiful. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. These edges are gorgeous. Oh, the wraparound is so insane. Well, I guess it's, uh, it's, it's getting me to get into the thinner paint, yeah? Considering I'm such a swiper. Excuse my sniffles. Um, Katie did suggest something on a video the other day. Katie Stinson Art. To come back and double check your edges throughout, you know, like every half hour or so for the first couple of hours. To try to slow that down. You know, anything going off. And I think that's a really good idea. Especially when you're working with something this fluid. I really want to tilt this way, so I'm going to try it. I'm sure I've got enough on there. Come on. Yeah, there's something. Oh, something was a little thicker in there. Maybe the black? Because it was so small. So it was such a small amount. Definitely want change in that. Let's see. See how that... That's so wild. Okay. It's tough. That's a tough one. I'm going to wreck a little bit. Oh, the bronze is coming up. Oh, I'm going to wreck in here a little bit. Let me get my gloves off. I really don't want to move much else. That's the only area that I'm like, bleh, not, not a fan. And I don't have, like, any other paint mix to do, like, a swipe in the middle or something. I just don't. Let me see if I can get a nice wrecking going on here. Might do something for me. Didn't know. I might not really should worry so much about it because there's so much good going on here. And with this kind of uh, oh gosh, what, Dwight pours. He he's the guy that does dump and swirls like. Crazy. Um, see, he would take this and scrap it. He, there's no way he would tolerate this section or this section. No way. But I, I love how the pink, the magenta that I put in the the purple color, is showing up. I think that's insane. So it is a little muddy right there f to me. But I really feel like to move any more of this would be 
detrimental to the beauty that's in there. So I'm wrecking. And wrecking and praying. Praying and wrecking. Wish I had more green. So I don't know the cat's actual family. I have no idea who it is. I don't know. But I call him Franklin. Because, hey, why not? So I did have a little red left, so I'm dipping my wrecker into that. I'm just kind of exploring with you guys. This is interesting. Yeah, that was interesting. Huh. Um. Okay. Brave New World. Oh, yeah. Anything, will anything stay around about that? I pulled some purple up, which is nice. I'm not going to touch it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put some fire in it. I'm going to stop while I'm ahead, okay? Oh, it's probably time for Nikolai to come home and she doesn't want him to walk. Oh, wow. Guys. Apparently I'm on a new kick, which is awesome because um, it's a lot more water than Floetrol and I'm getting well with the Floetrol. Wreck in there. Shoot, where's my record now? Reckon could do an awful lot for you. But it takes a little patience. I'm not saying that I'm good at it, but I feel much better about it than I used to. I used to not really like wrecking at all, to tell you the truth. There's there's a lady I can't remember her name. She does um, 
what she calls like stained glass and so she swipes wrecks and spins i think that's the order i've done a couple of videos trying to replicate and she's really good at wrecking <laughs> she's really good at it. i can't remember her name her husband does the filming for her and it's kind of sweet Um, yeah, it's kind of sweet. It's really sweet, actually. Gosh, I, I hope the name comes to me before I get up here. If not, I'm going to throw her YouTube channel down in the, the description. Because I, I know I follow her, so it's, I'm going to be able to find her. Huh. I'm wondering. Yep, I'm not completely done with that green. Let me keep playing. See, I got a little left in there. Oh, I have a lot left in there. Wow. All right, I got to be careful. I, my sleeve just went down. I end up getting it all over the place. Just trying to put some edges on it. Huh. I gotta slow it down. I gotta stop. But man, I got a lot more green in here than I thought I would. I don't know what to do. I don't I don't want to waste the green, but I don't want to keep going on this. Oh, I do have an idea. This was super popular with the other one with Wayne. He was like, I love that. And I'm like, oh, okay. Good. So I'm gonna drag some green. Making a fissure. Oh, here comes the cat. I don't know what she's going to do. As long as she don't jump on the wet painting, which is fine, actually. I'm going to do the other side. I'm going to the other side. I'm going to stop playing with that middle section. I'm going to let it dry as it wants to dry because there's way too much good going on for me to go blowing this whole painting up and wasting all that paint just to get rid of that section. I really, really, that's not, I'm not into that. 
Not into it. It's going to be fine. It's going to be just fine. I just, there's nothing else I could, I could pull off on that. I mean, maybe I could, nope, it's just going to get muddier. I'm going to leave it alone. I'm going to let God have his way with this painting. I'm really impressed. And we'll see how good I get at this. And, um, obviously, watch your black, lady. I am going to save that little bit of green. I am. Gosh, I'm wondering. Oh gosh, here I go. Couldn't resist it, guys. I couldn't do it. So, yeah, I, I did a thing. <laughs> oh, man, I'm funny. I'm like, yeah, I'm all done. I'm not going to touch it again. I lied. I lied right to your faces. I go with that green and do the same thing. <sighs> you know, sometimes I wonder if you guys even ever talk to me. Just kidding. <laughs> this is not live. Glad I kept being a crazy lady. Yep, I'm happy I did that. Okay. And let me tell you what, when you're experimenting like that, it's very difficult to be happy with yourself. Because it's scary. But I have a feeling that's going to dry. Epic. Let's see if I have any air in my lungs. Not really. I have to use straws because my lungs aren't great. I should give it a little bit of cells. Uh huh. Oh, I have so much fun with you guys. Sorry if I drive you crazy. I hope I'm not driving you too crazy. This is going to be interesting dry. I can't wait to see it dry. I think it's beautiful. Certainly, some people will be like, no way I'd stop right there. And But you know what? I've learned... 
it's it's not really about that. It's about getting into a medium you love and trying to learn and enjoy and share it with people. Let's get you down for a closer look, okay? All right. So we can see that's going to do something. It's going to be interesting. I'm just glad that I kept going with that crazy line. We've got some nice stuff going on here. I'm going to keep playing with this method. Look at them wonky boulders. I love wonky boulders. They're going to have depth when they dry. Look at this. Stop. What? Look at this. The lacing is exquisite. I'm going to come back in 45 minutes. I'll show you some more. See what's happened in 45 minutes. Because this is kind of painting that you need to wait. Let's see what happens. Well, here we are almost 24 hours later. I knew I was going to come back in 45 minutes, but uh, the day got away. I really love this painting, and I'm even happy about what happened in the middle. Um, I was a little worried about that yesterday because there's so much of this painting that I loved, and it actually worked out. It looks wild, and it's absolutely beautiful. Thank you.